Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. And I just, there are a couple of things that are coming up in the astral stories in the newosphere right now that I don't have answers to, but I'd like to describe them in case there are others that do have notions about what to do about them. Uh, there's an astral story about, there's probably news to support this from time to time uh, in the media. Uh, and there's an astral story about men who gather in small groups, friends who gather in small groups, and um, uh, on the weekends they get drunk and go raiding around and uh, shoot men that they think, suspect may be homosexuals. And so uh, I think that technically this is called uh, latent homosexuality. Uh, in other words, the assumption is sometimes made that people who do this, who like uh, crowd or gangbang or kill homosexuals and claim that they are doing it um, because they deserve it, um, are really expressing their own fear of feelings that they have of homosexuality or male-to-male -male sexual bonding. I think that's it. And so, but then uh, there's some, there are other stories circulating around about um, law enforcement in prisons, um, uh, raping male prisoners to um, preserve, like the to to bring them down a, a notch and um, ha uh, cause them to behave appropriately or submissively as part of the prison population. So they do it to preserve peace in the jail. And uh, this um, seems to me to be uh, an excuse for acting out uh, latent homosexual desires without, uh, like, the without the conscious mind admitting that that's what's happening. Which I don't know. I haven't read any literature on that one. And then there's another situation where. Um, uh, latent homosexual urges suppressed in the subconscious mind are rising into the conscious awareness of straight men. And, um, and then they're acting out on the astral plane in groups, um, scenes of similar to those that, these, the, that other people are acting out in, in reality. So the, the astral rape stories seem to be right now mostly men descending on women and raping them, so that wouldn't be pertinent. In the past, in years past, sometimes they descended on a man to, uh, to f cause a heart attack, but that's not happening uh, right now. And now it seems to be um, that they're doing group bonding by visualizing M to M sex acts, which is subconscious image relating to primate and um, feral other feral drives to do with um, pack ordering. So, so the males in a, in a primate pack do that to establish who's the leader and who's, who's the loyal follower. Um, so so it's, um, it's a symbolic sort of um, homosexual act occurring, not acted out, but occurring on the astral plane. And um, it seems to be mostly uncomfortable for women um, because it morphs into the pack, the male pack, um, uh, astrally r raping women. Um, and I don't really know what to say about that. It also morphs into um, violent fantasies of men killing, um, one representing the pack in killing, I guess you would say, like a primate instinct or a wolf pack instinct to take down the prey animal. Yeah, 
it moves into that territory where where the pack pulls down an animal and they all eat the animal um, and and the feeling uh, newospheric feeling is rather like that there's the feeling of the that one one man visualizes killing you know what that's what it is and um, the rest of the pack that has been practicing um, symbolic acts of M to M sexuality mm, it follows him with their mind. They glom to him and, and crowd after him, astrally crowd onto the victim um, as if they were all killing at the same time in their minds. And that's sort of the way that wolf packs operate too. You know, the whole pack is involved quite frequently in a kill. So, so what I'm wondering is how we can mitigate this recurrent fantasy that's that's flowing around through the newosphere right now, to do with um, feral the feral drives of pack ordering, male pack ordering, and uh, pulling down of the prey. Uh, so I'm I'm asking for answers, and in the meantime, I wish you all well. Godspeed in, in peacefully and joyfully um, experiencing the amazing newospheric changes of these days.